Hey everyone, ever heard the saying where there's a will, there's a way? Well, internet service providers live by that. Even with DNS over HTTPS, they still find ways to block your access to websites. Today, we'll dive into how ISPs can manage a DNS over HTTPS block and how you can outsmart them. First, let's cover what DNS over HTTPS is. Imagine you're visiting catmemes.com because who wouldn't want to? Your computer uses DNS to look up the site's IP address. But these requests are usually sent in plain text, like a postcard anyone can read, especially your ISP. But DNS over HTTPS changes the game. Instead of a plain text postcard, it puts up the request in a locked box. Only a website can open. This means ISP shouldn't be able to see what you're locking up. In theory, it's private. But in practice, not so much. With DNS over HTTPS, you would think your ISP is powerless. But they do have a few tricks up their sleeves to block DNS over HTTPS connections. The first is IP block. Even if your DNS requests are hidden, ISPs can still see the IP addresses of servers you're connecting to. And they might just block the IP outright. It's like trying to send a locked box. but the postal worker recognizes the address and stops it. Next is deep packet inspection. Internet service providers also use DPI to dig deeper. It's like an internet security scan for your traffic. Even though your DNS requests are encrypted, DPI can analyze patterns to detect where you're headed, which is one way they can block DNS over HTTPS without directly seeing your DNS queries. Then, there's SNI spoofing. During the initial handshake between your device and the server, the server name is still visible. ISPs can straight up block you based on this. Well, ISPs are crafty, but that doesn't mean we're helpless. So, what can you do to fight back? A VPN is a great way to avoid these blocks. It encrypts all your traffic and hides your destination by routing it through its own server. This way, your ISP only sees you connecting to a VPN server and nothing beyond it. This is a super effective way to avoid DNS over HTTPS blocking attempts by your ISP. Another tool is encrypted server name indication, which basically encrypts the SNI, hiding the server name during the handshake so ISPs can't block it. Remember guys, privacy is a right and staying ahead of your ISP is just a part of the game. So there you have it. Even with DNS over HTTPS, ISPs can still find a way to block you. But now, you know their tricks and most importantly, how to get around them. With VPNs and ESNI, you're back in control. If you found this video helpful, give it a big thumbs up, subscribe and share it. Let's help everyone keep their browsing private. Stay safe, keep your internet traffic locked up and I'll see you in the next video.